All right. Um, I'm a little early to work. I'm just sitting here thinking about um, taking that trip. I think uh, it's a good idea. Uh, just kind of a solo trip um, for a couple of weeks. I've been. There's a lot, a lot to it. Uh, one is that I like wasting time and I kind of meander from place to place, but I'll have to be more, a little more vigilant on mapping it out. I think what I'm going to do is uh, go from Dallas to um, uh, Minneapolis, just go up I-35, and then it's all it's my, it's all freeway the first part, and then go from east to west through North Dakota in Montana and then uh, hook into Idaho and then kind of go back down through Salt Lake City and then there's uh, South Utah there's Highway 12 which is supposed to be gorgeous I want to do that and then I can hook to Southern Colorado and go through the Rockies down there the Rocky Mountains on that west side Durango and all that and then hook back over to some major freeways and then kind of work my way back down um so i think that is the way to go the tricky the last time i took a long meandering trip like this i didn't have a job i quit my job and i was moving up here and uh i think that's a big part of it when you have nothing but time it's it's so freeing um that's what i can't do this time obviously because i gotta work i could take a couple weeks but I have to really kind of think it out ahead of time how much I want to, uh, you know, where I want to go and what my time frame is. But the other trip, even though I had nothing but time, it was about two weeks, and I was by the end of it, I was pretty exhausted. But I think if I map it out a little bit better than I did the first time, and also um, take a lot of breaks, like before, I would drive someplace, stay the night, get up next day, just drive, get to another place get a hotel wake up the next day drive um this time i think it would be more like the the important thing is to get to up to the minneapolis is you know within a couple of days and then i can really kind of take my time going across and then down and back around um and a lot of it the first two thirds of it is all freeway basically then the other uh one third of it um going back down and around is then it starts to get into uh, highways and real gorgeous scenery and all that. But that's that's the goal is to kind of do a big loop across uh, around the middle of the United States. So I think that's what I'm going to do. And I think uh, probably March is a good time. That way it gives me time to save up some money for it. And also it's after the harshest part of winter. Uh, it's still probably pretty cool and all that going up you know through north dakota and montana and all that but uh, i think it'll be good so that's what i'm thinking of and i'm uh that's my plan anyway that's what i'm i'm looking at so anyway those are just my thoughts